What's going on guys? Today I am back with another Destiny 2 video and today I have for you something epic, exclusive PvP gameplay of the Hunter's new or remastered Blade Dancer subclass, the Arc Strider. But before we get into the video guys, if you want to be in with a chance of winning this Resurrectionist emblem, simply drop a like on the video and leave a comment. Details are on screen now. The gameplay in the background as well was recorded by GameSpot. The full video is linked in the video description if you do want to check it out. Pretty decent Deej interview regarding Destiny 2. Definitely worth your time checking out for damn sure. Okay, so getting into the gameplay in the background. We see the Hunter's new Arc Strider subclass tearing it up in PvP. Now, I'm going to take everything back I said about this subclass. I was going about thinking that it was just going to be the Blade Dancer with a pole in his hand. But actually seeing it, actually seeing footage of it, it looks completely different. Okay, fair enough. Blade Dancer kind of does the same thing. You glide across the screen, you kill people, you slash them, you land that kill. It's as simple as that. This does the same thing, but to be honest, it looks like a, well, I wouldn't say new subclass. It looks like a subclass built from the ground up to resemble the Blade Dancer, but way more controllable. Because in my opinion, the Blade Dancer isn't that controllable. I mean, you're all over the place. You don't know what direction you're going to slash. Most of the time, you don't anyway. This looks way more controllable, in my opinion. And the actual look of the thing, it looks incredible when he's standing there and the electric's running through that rod. I mean, I'm seriously digging this. I mean, Hunter's my main as well. So I'm definitely going to be using the Arc Strider a lot more than I used the Blade Dancer in Destiny 1 for damn sure. So what do we actually know about this Arc Strider subclass? Well, we know the grenades it has. It has Skip Grenade, Flux Grenade, and it has Arc Bolt Grenade. Jumps, we have High Jump, Strafe Jump, and Triple Jump. No blink is returning to the actual subclass, so you are not going to be able to blink above people and confuse them because that always happened to me in PvP. Someone blinked towards me, I'd just be so confused, I'd just stand there and most of the time let them kill me. So, yes, no blink is returning to a hunter within Destiny 2. The third ability it has is the same across the board. It has the, basically what we know now as the Shade Step. It has the Marksman Dodge, which reloads your equipped weapon when dodging. Or it's got the Gambler's Dodge, which generates melee energy when you dodge near enemies. Now the other two paths of four perks this actual subclass has is Where the Warrior, which offers combat flow, recharges your dodge class ability upon a melee kill, Deadly Reach extends the range of your melee lunge temporary after a dodge, Lethal Current, your arc staff attacks hit twice after dodging, and Shocking Blow, melee attacks emit lightning on a strike. And the other path of four perks is called Way of the Wind. Disorienting blow, striking an enemy with this melee disorients them, leaving them vulnerable. Then we have Lightning Reflexes. You take less damage while dodging when your arc staff is active. We have Battle Meditation. When critically wounded, melee and grenades recharge drastically faster. And we have Focused Breathing. With this ability active, sprinting reduces your dodge cooldown and you gain increased sprint speed. So yes, that's basically the loadout of the Arc Strider subclass. Now the beta comes are July 18th on PlayStation and July 19th on Xbox. And we actually get to try out all three new subclasses, that being the Arc Strider, that being the Titan Sentinel, and that being the Warlock's Dawn Blade. So I can just not wait until July 18th and July 19th so we get our hands on this actual subclass. I'm actually really surprised of how decent it looks. It looks 100 times better than I expected, not gonna lie. But guys, that is it for another video. Let me know what you think about this down below in that comment section. If you're new around here and enjoy Daily Destiny videos, make sure you subscribe and I will as always see you on that next one. <laughs>